Basal cell skin cancer is the most common type of skin cancer. It usually starts out as a little pink shiny bump or clear shiny bump that grows and bleeds. I usually tell my patients that if there's a spot that has been there, a growth, for more than a month and it hasn't gone away, that that's something that should get looked into. Um, and um, the head and neck are most common places for basal cell skin cancer to occur, although 20% um, of basal cell skin cancers can occur on other parts of the body as well. Um, squamous cell skin cancers start out as crusty or scaly bumps, so if there's a flaky area that keeps growing and gets harder and more crusty, that's something that should get your attention. Um, they can start as um, pink bumps also that are more scaly, and they can get painful as well. Um, and the head, neck, and arms are the most common places for squamous cell skin cancer. Melanoma is the least common but most deadly type of skin cancer, and that usually um, starts out um, looking like a mole, um, which is um, irregular in color or shape. Um, we usually think about um, the A, B, C, D, E's for skin cancer, which for melanoma, the A is asymmetry, where one side doesn't look like the other side. B is for border irregularity, jagged edges to a mole. C is for color variation with um, varying colors um, in the same mole, and D is for diameter bigger than a pencil eraser. Um, and E is a new criteria, which means evolving or enlarging, um, and that's a mole that's changing over time, and that's one of the most sensitive criteria that we have now for melanoma.